Good Tuesday morning to you. Thank you so much for joining us here on the CW4 at 7. The time now is 718. You have made it now to the month of June and June 1st in the world of meteorology means two things. Number one, it means it's the start of meteorological summer. So from here on out through August, we are going to be dealing with summertime weather, including the warm, humid conditions and those longer days. From here on out, we still have nine minutes of daylight to gain between now and June 20th, which is the summer solstice, which is the longest day of the year as the sun is going to be in the northern hemisphere, bringing us that daylight for 14 hours, 22 minutes, and 32 seconds. After June 20th, as the sun now starts moving back down towards the southern hemisphere, those daytime hours are going to start shortening and it's going to get darker at night as we near the December solstice, the winter solstice actually on December 21st. It is also the first day of hurricane season 2021 for the Atlantic Basin, so it's going to get active in the tropics from here on out. NOAA came out with their latest forecast about a week and a half ago, calling for another above average season. We already had an early start with subtropical storm Anna. I'm hoping we don't go through this list again, because if we end up going through the original list, we're no longer going to be using the Greek names. We're going to start using these names, but I'm hoping we don't go to the second list. So of course, we'll be watching things here in the tropics in the first alert forecast center. Right now, we have nothing going on in the tropics. Everything is quiet for now for us here. We're just going to be dealing with the return of a summertime weather pattern with daily storm chances in the afternoon when we get the peak daytime heating. So keep the umbrella on standby pretty much every day from here on out throughout the summer season. It's going to be warm in the 80s. And of course, you know, it's not summer without that wonderful summer humidity and all of that moisture that we have been not having to worry about from the Gulf of Mexico over the last several days. That's all going to creep back up here. So, you know, it's about to get very humid as we head into the summer months. Currently, we are waking up this morning to some mild temperatures in the 60s. Clouds have been building in on our Alpha Insurance Skycam over the last several hours. Those morning lows in the 40s and 50s we had, that is all gone. And now we just have the clouds and a little bit of some moisture coming in from Arkansas and the Delta. This is all courtesy of our next system that's going to push eastward, bringing all this moisture into our region, which is why those rain chances are going to increase midweek. This is Tucker, our forecast pet for this morning. Temperatures today should top out around 85, 86 degrees by this afternoon. Noon, then rain chances will increase, storm chances increasing Wednesday into Thursday, then scattered showers and storms Friday and the weekend.